Hey guys, Firestarter here, just uh, checking in. I wanted to give everybody an update on nutrition uh, and what I'm eating and what I'm loving on the trail, just in case uh, you're gonna take any any trips yourself and are looking for some yummy food. Um, but first, I wanted to thank my friend Tammy Landreth for this awesome custom hat. It has a little wasp nest, some moss, literally have a feather in my cap, y'all. And it's all custom done by Tammy. She's so creative. Um, it's really a cool, cool thing. So anyway, um, down to food. So snacks are really important. I love Sour Patch Kids. Always have those in um, granola bars, basic, in the hilt belt pocket. I really like this uh, power mix, trail mix. It's heavy on the seeds and fruits, which um, I've been told are really difficult to find kind of on trail. But as far as like pre-packaged, freeze-dried meals, you really can't beat this brand. It's Peak Refuel. Um, this is one of their dinners. If you've watched my videos, you've probably seen recently uh, this brand showing up a lot, but it, it all of their food is delicious. So, I'm going to miss a lot in their stuff. I've got this one. Chicken pesto is delicious. Um, cheesy broccoli and rice. Um, all of those are great. And then they even have really wonderful desserts, too. Um, peach cobbler is awesome. This can feed, like, four people, though. Seriously, it's so rich and yummy. And it's nice because it's warm. Um... And so, I have those for sure. Um, I think Mountain House is probably the brand that I'll find um, most often on trail. So, even though I really don't like this brand, I'm working it into my diet. Because <laughs> I know I'm going to have to eat it. So, um, And I'll be grateful for it when I have it, I'm sure. Um, and then, also another really great brand is Packet Gourmet. This is a... A family who's been doing their own freeze-dried meals for a really long time since like the early 80s or so but they have some really good ones um, this is their skillet biscuits and sausage gravy I just use the bottom of my um, of my big pot that I showed you before um, as a skillet to make these but um, I can't have the sausage so this is for a guest um, they also make really good morning smoothies. You just pour in some cool water, let it sit for a little bit, and then you have a kind of a jump start to your day. Get your fruits and a little bit of milk, uh, protein, stuff like that going for the day. Um, <clears throat> my friends from New Jersey got me this brand of sort of, um, paleo meal. So it's really heavy on protein, vegetables, pretty much only protein and vegetables. Um, I really hit this up with a lot of my spices on the trail. It's pretty good, that chili brand. Um, and then, you know, this one, again, from Packet Gourmet, one of my favorites. You just bring a tortilla and make this huge um, chicken burrito. It's like something you would get at Chipotle or Moe's or something really good. And then, um, if I'm taking guests with me, which I have been, um, and I'm planning on doing that as much as I can and training just because I want to spend time with my friends and family as much as I can, um, I'll make a big pot of soup. And I really like Bear Creek, um, soups. This is probably one I'm going to make at the end of the month. Good for cold weather. And then everybody knows I have to have my coffee. So... I really love Starbucks coffee, so I just do the Via. Um, it's yummy. And then I have all of these individually packaged um, creamers and sugars and stuff um, that I can take with me too. But I really need to learn how to go without coffee, number one, or drink it black or both. So, got some goals to work on nutrition-wise. Um, also really love this cocoa as there's a little treat um as far as um other meals i'm gonna try these this weekend um i hear they're really delicious so i'll report back but this is um again like a whole complete meal 
it has 700 calories, which you need a lot of calories when you're on trail. So, um, this one, you just basically add some cool water, shake it up, drink it. It's a chocolate shake. And, um, you know, it's got a lot of, you know, sort of, it's an ultra light meal replacement. So we'll see how it tastes. And then I got all kinds of snacks. I always have to have chocolate. Love chocolate and cheese. So anyways, I always bring some chocolate with me. Um, pretzels. These little strawberry graham crackers are delicious. I love those, especially with some Jeff peanut butter. Um, just candy and, and snacks mostly beyond that. But um, on the hydration side, I really like this um, liquid IV. It's liquid IV, uh, sugar free. Here it is. And I really like this peach, uh, white peach flavor, but it just kind of pumps up your water. But I think um, my favorite is drip drop. Um, everybody likes to drip drop, so you can also use that or whatever you can find. But those are some of my favorites, and it's been helping me kind of keep some hydration down. So anyway, that's an update. I uh, just wanted to check in, let you know what I'm learning, what I'm finding. I'm going to be putting some boxes together. Um, I think for resupply, just to have some things that I know I really like to eat show up every once in a while on trail, just as a morale booster. I'm not really depending on it, um, but it's just something to look forward to. I like having those things. So anyway, I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye.